Hello world, I'm Rich, and it's Rich's World Beer Tour. It's coming out on a Monday. I uh, filmed this last night, uh, Sunday night. What a day in Minnesota. Gorgeous, mid-70s. Me and Pete got a uh, batch of beer brewed. Um, I got 10 miles in walking. I got a bunch of garden work done back here, bunch of weeds pulled, bunch of stuff harvested. Um, I need a beer. You know what, I looked in the fridge, now that it's fall, I found one that I've had for a while and uh, kind of forgot about. Uh, Maury sent this to me from uh, Lavery Brewing Company, uh, Erie, Pennsylvania, the Devil's Pumpkin Ale. It's ale brewed with pumpkin and spices. Our friends at Lavery, now I'm, Maury sent me this, and it's been a while, so I'm assuming this is a 2014. Uh, bottle conditioned, I'm trying to see what uh, what if we got an ABV? 6.5% ABV. The Devil's Pumpkin Ale. Unfiltered and bottle conditioned. Nice little story on the side. Sitting down by the garden, sitting down by the fire pit. We're going to get a fire going. We're going to get a little something. Uh, enjoy a beer and uh, not have to swap mosquitoes. I think they're uh, maybe gone for the year. A little pour on this. Of course, I'm getting aggressive with the pour, like the bottle says not to. Now, you guys know, full disclosure, I am not a pumpkin ale guy. This is, it's just all ruby red on the side, maybe a half finger's worth of head. Um, there is not a lot going on there. Just it's gorgeous red. Oof. Heavy cinnamon. Heavy cinnamon. Cinnamon and uh, I do get some pumpkin. But it, that, that cinnamon and uh, what are the other spices in a pumpkin pie? Nutmeg. Nutmeg. Boom. There it is. My lovely assistant off camera provides the answer. It's cinnamon and nutmeg that I'm getting. It smells nice. A little pumpkin. Uh, I don't know, a little pumpkin pie. Let's give it a try. Cheers, world. Nice, nice mouthfeel. Smooth with a crisp note. Really crisp note of, uh, I don't know what. It, it's almost. Let me dive in one more time. It's almost like a Chardonnay note. That is the oddest thing in this. It's a crisp Chardonnay type note. Um, I get the pumpkin, the, the spices in it, in the taste, seem to uh, accentuate the alcohol. I taste the alcohol in this. Um, it's a... I like the ale component within it. The spices still seem a little a little heavy for me. Boy, I do got bugs out here. Um, there's a little graham cracker with it. I mean, this is almost kind of a pumpkin pie kind of thing. The the graham cracker, the pumpkin, the spices, um, it, the alcohol hits me. Even for 6.5 percent, it uh, gives me. Uh, it's a boozy pumpkin pie. Um, again, this is not my style. Um, although this is one of the better ones that I've had. It's just not a style that I dig. I, I don't know if it's pumpkin and beer combined, if it's just the pumpkin flavor. I do like pumpkin pie, but I don't know. Um, I'm going to give this an 8.25. Um, it's good. It, it probably other people, I got to go watch some other reviews. It probably should score higher. I think it's just my not, not love of it. So anyways, Maury, thank you. Uh, if you guys need to check out Maury's channel, you please do. The Erie Better Beer Bureau those guys do some great reviews, little hidden uh, uh, hidden beer reviews, and uh, 
they've got some of the biggest beers around. Uh, these guys get find some big beers to review. Um, so check it out, Erie Better Beer Bureau. Uh, Maury, thank you. Again, it's uh, from Lavery Brewing in Erie, Pennsylvania. The Devil's Pumpkin Ale. Our friends in Erie, Pennsylvania. Thanks for sharing another beer with me, world. Cheers, Maury.